A couple of weeks ago, it was the sun stealing the show during the solar eclipse, and tonight it will be a meteor shower on full display. Meteorologist Robert Spetta is on your side with how you can watch some fireballs in the night sky. If sky conditions are clear enough over the upcoming days, you may see a few bright fireballs in the night sky. That is all thanks to the Lyrid meteor shower. The meteor shower is courtesy of Comet Thatcher that passed the Earth way back in 1861. It won't return to our neck of the solar system until 2283. But despite that, we can continue to see the debris, its tail left behind on an annual basis as the Earth passes through it. Now the best time to view it will be after midnight from the 21st heading into the 22nd as the Earth passes through that debris field. In the best conditions, you can see up to 10 to 15 meteors per hour in this shower. But here's the catch. The skies need to be clear and you need to have dark skies. With the full moon peaking on the 23rd, you may only be able to see some of the brightest of the meteors peeking on through. But it only takes one to make it rememberable. And if you miss this one, another meteor shower will take place on May 4th and May 5th. That will be the Aquarius meteor shower, which should have much better viewing. I'm meteorologist Robert Spetta, First Coast News on your side.